Hey guys, Jason here. Welcome to my seventh episode of my new Metal and Beer series. Metal and Beer. I love heavy metal guitar and I love drinking good craft beer. The two just seem to go together quite nicely. So in this video, I'm going to help expand your knowledge and your skills on how to play metal guitar. And the focus is going to be on metal riffing, which just means moving around a lot on your metal rhythms. So let's bring it in closer, I'll throw up the tablature, and of course at the end of the video, we'll have a beer tasting. Alrighty, so now I want to break this lesson down a little further for you. Now the purpose of this heavy metal guitar lesson is simply to get you used to moving those fingers around on the fretboard in that upper area. As heavy metal guitar players, it's real easy and common to get stuck in that play heavy and we get stuck in, in the power chords and such. Hey, there's a time and place for that and that's awesome. It's the foundation of heavy metal. However, if you get stuck in that, you tend to not transition over into playing actual riffs which is another part of heavy metal music and what makes heavy metal so great. So I want us to learn to transition from the heavy power chords, the heavy notes, into actually moving those fingers around a bit and playing riffs. So I encourage you to go back and learn this lesson note for note and practice it. Practice it over and over. It's like working out. You know, you have to do it often you know and, and get better at it and of course i always encourage you guys to take what i give you use it as a guide and expand on it then you get to the point where you're playing those heavy notes those power chords and then you're integrating the riffage in with it that makes you one amazing heavy metal guitar player so you're probably wondering by now hmm what's jason drinking today well, I'm glad you asked. Today I am drinking Maduro Brown L from Cigar City. Now, my good friend Rob turned me on to Maduro a couple of years ago. And Rob, if you're watching this, I know this is one of your favorite beers, if not your very favorite beer. So, I'm going to drink this for you. <laughs> Before we taste, let's uh, read the little blurb on the back. I love when beer companies do this. So, Maduro Brown L has hints of caramel, toffee, chocolate, and espresso. They're all displayed in this complex yet approachable brown ale. It's a great food beer and pairs equally well with sweet chocolate based desserts and roasted meat. Now I love chocolate and I love roasted meat. Never had Maduro with either of those but I'll be trying that next. <laughs> so let's give it a taste. Cheers or as we say in Thai, Chun Gao. Mmm, delicious. Now, it's got a bold taste, but it's not overpowering in any of the flavors that I mentioned. And again, Maduro is by Cigar City Brewing. Now, that's a pretty famous brewery here in the Tampa Bay area where I live, and I've actually been to their brewery several times. Very cool place to visit. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed my beer tasting event. I hope you enjoyed today's metal guitar lesson. As always, until next time, keep it metal.